the leasing system so this is our content that we will cover in this lecture so now talking about the built up compression member now i have already discussed about it what is built up section well built up sections are those sections which are composed of two or more sections so basically built up sections are used uh, in case when there is a large load and for the efficient use of material we use built up uh, sections and now as we are talking about the compression member so we can say built up columns so built up columns are also known as combined column or open web columns and generally in this uh, we use two or more than two sections to uh, so that they act as a single unit now as i said built up sections are generally made up of two or two or more individual sections such as uh, angle sections channel sections i sections and they are properly connected along their length by lacing or battening so that they act as a act together as a single unit so uh, there may be a combination of channel section like this or there may be a combination of channel section like this similarly uh, two i section can be combined together and along the length say for example in in the length they will look like this they will look like this so to connect these two uh, sections generally what we do is we use some connections uh, to connect them so those connections uh, we will see what are those connection so generally we we connect them uh, either using the lacing system or using the batten system we will see that in the in the diagram uh, how they look like so as i said according to the type of connection between the cords well in in case of built up section as uh, in this case you can see as these are the main components that are to be connected so these main components are called sometimes the cords and to connect these main component we use some connection like uh, the lacing system and the batten system or the combination of uh, these so in the in the third uh, third uh, line we can see according to the type of connection between the cords built up member may be classified as now uh, they may be classified as laced member so in the in the in this case we use lacing system to connect uh, the main component of the built up section similarly we can use uh, struts with batten plates we will see all these in the diagram in the next slide or batten struts or sometimes if we are connecting angle section so uh, sometimes we use perforated uh, cover plate also to connect all the parts so in that case uh, they are members with perforated cover plates so now in this uh, now we will see how they look like so here in this diagram you can see the first diagram is laced members so in in the section you can see these are the two channel sections and this is the uh, longitudinal section you can see here so in this you can see this cross uh, this crossing which which is being used to connect these uh, member they are called lacing and in between them there are some horizontal members horizontal plates are used these are called battens so generally lacing system is used in combination with the battens uh, for the effective uh, use for the efficient uh, use similarly in the in the b diagram you can see this is uh, struts with batten plates so in this case uh, these are the two channel sections and they are connected with this horizontal plates only so there is no inclined members used to connect them so in that case this will be called as uh, struts with batten plates similarly sometimes uh, this these batten struts sometimes uh, they are being used in between the channel sections so this is the batten struts so sometimes they are they are also used well they are not very much effective and that is why generally they are not very much uh, popular the popular system that is being uh, used in built up connection is uh, this one and to some extent this one this system is very good in supporting eccentric load also but when there is an axial load only in that case this second point i mean this second type of column which is uh, with the batten plate system this is more i mean this is uh, good in supporting axially loaded column but the first one it is the best uh, configuration best connection that we can uh, use uh, in case of built up sections now in the fourth case 
this is a special case in which sometimes what we do is we uh, connect i mean if i see the plan if if i cut the cross section of this it will look like this there are uh, some channel section there are some angle sections they will look like this so to connect these uh, four angle sections we use sometimes the plates like this so this is the plate that we generally use to connect them and sometimes what we do is we perforate them uh, at a regular interval uh, so that uh, we can access inside also uh, now now some we provide this perforation for various purpose like uh, for painting inside inside part so sometimes we made some this kind of uh, perforation so that is why this kind of uh, column will be called as perforated column okay so there are various types of uh, built up sections so now i will be showing you the uh, isometric view of the built up uh, sections uh, which are more popular so in this case you can see the same uh, the same uh, built up section you can see in the isometric view so built up section look like this uh, so they are called uh, face to face connected in this case uh, channel sections are in this configuration while in the second case you can see they are back to back i mean in this case their back is connected okay so based on different uh, configuration they are known as like uh, face to face connected or back to back connected and these are the most uh, i mean these are very common when we uh, we are supposed to support uh, a large load so for heavy load we generally use such kind of configuration this one and for the light load we can use uh, this this one so now we can have more uh, isometric view like in this case this is the case of uh, batten system in this there is no inclined member but in this case uh, inclined members are also used so whenever we are using lacing system we generally provide this uh, tie plate at the top and at the bottom so that uh, i mean this is the case of uh, angle system which are being connected using the lacing system so at top and bottom we generally provide the this uh, plate which is called tie plate okay so so that they they hold together 